So as I told you in the beginning, we are going to see a little bit about this kingdom of Saudi Arabia. And Mr. Ambassador, thank you for coming. Thank you very much for coming to our program. It's an honor. Thank you very much. And Mai is going to be with me for this interview. Good evening. Uh, Good evening. Let me introduce you to the uh, audience. Nacido en la Meca, el embajador Esam Altagafi es licenciado en Información y Relaciones Públicas, especializado en Ciencias Políticas, e ingresó en el Ministerio de Asuntos Exteriores de Arabia Saudita en 1981. Luego de desempeñarse en las representaciones diplomáticas de su país ante México, Estados Unidos y Brunei, fue designado embajador en Argentina en agosto de 2006. Muchos se preguntarán, eh, ¿el Reino de Arabia Saudita, bueno, en qué es, ¿Dónde está? Bueno, es eh, Arabia, el Reino de Arabia Saudita, Arabia Saudí o simplemente Arabia Saudita, es un país de la península arábica, limita con Irak, Jordania, Kuwait, Oman, Qatar, los Emiratos Árabes Unidos y Yemen. Su forma de gobierno es una monarquía cuyo rey es su Alteza Abdallah bin Abdelaziz al Saud, también transcrito como el rey Abdullah. La superficie del país es extensa como la Argentina, sin las provincias de Buenos Aires, Santa Cruz y Jujuy. Es un país de gran extensión, con aproximadamente 28.200.000 habitantes. Mientras su PBI es análogo al de Argentina, su Producto Bruto Per Cápita es un 57%, eh, 57 perdón, mayor al de la Argentina. La capital eh, y ciudad principal, por supuesto, es Riad, con aproximadamente 7 millones de habitantes. Es uno de los grandes centros económicos, Riyadh, de todo Medio Oriente, pr probablemente el principal. Y otras grandes ciudades son también Jida, por supuesto La Meca y Medina, estas dos últimas, especialmente desde el punto de vista religioso. Arabia Saudita, como les decía, cuenta por sí solo con un cuarto de las reservas mundiales de petróleo, del cual es el primer productor y exportador. Mr. Ambassador... In a few words and a few images, would you describe to us the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia? Well, first of all, thank you very much. It's uh, the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia, the center of the uh, Muslim world and uh, the country uh, where uh, Mecca and Medina, the two holy cities, are located. It's the direction of all Muslims around the world where they face Mecca every day for uh, their uh, prayers. Uh, Saudi Arabia is a modern country. Uh, you just mentioned that it's the first producer of oil and the tenth uh, producer of natural gas. Uh, Saudi Arabia is one of the international uh, community and uh, one, of course, a uh, member of the Arab League and the G20 that we and share. And of course, uh, G20 lately. We are together of in the course, G20. We are together and, in G20. And you mentioned uh, just uh, before, you mentioned the two holy sites. I mean, exactly. why is your king also called the custodian of the two holy mosques? Well, the custodian of the two holy mosques is the king of Saudi Arabia. It's uh, all the former kings of Saudi Arabia were titled the same uh, title. It means uh, the one who pay more attention, the one who care about the two holy mosques in Mecca and Medina and the holy sites uh, beside these two uh, places. Uh, it means that... Uh, The king Fahad, the former king of Saudi Arabia, replaced the title of His Majesty the King uh, to be the custodian of the two holy mosques. And for us, as Saudis, and for the Saudi kings, it's an honor, uh, actually, to serve uh, these two holy places. And it's an honor to serve all the pilgrims who visit Saudi Arabia, who visit Mecca and Medina every year, millions of them, I mean. Mm -hmm. Which are uh, Saudi Arabia's main driving forces for generating economic wealth? And how important are natural resources in the generation of this wealth? I'm sure petroleum is one of them. Of course. Well, uh, as you mentioned, uh, oil is the, 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 the first uh, production of uh, Saudi Arabia. It's about uh, 425 uh, uh, tons 
uh, yearly, and the reserve is more than 36 billion of tons. Uh, it's uh, about the first reserve of oil in, in, in the world. In the world yeah. And uh, at the same time, it's the fifth producer of uh, natural uh, gas. Uh, of course, oil takes the, the, the major place of the income of, uh, of the kingdom. Uh, at the same time, uh, the kingdom of Saudi Arabia is trying uh, to uh, diversify the income of the country. So, in that, uh, we can say, uh, lately, uh, Saudi Arabia is uh, trying uh, to use the, the uh, agriculture programs, the, the, the uh, uh, industrial programs uh, to uh, uh, diversify the income of Saudi Arabia, which is now more than 30 percent of the 30 percent. And which is which are the key business areas uh, your country is focusing uh, on developing? Mm -hmm. Well, before uh, 1975, uh, Saudi Arabia were uh, producing the rude oil. Uh, in 1975, we established two industrial, uh, petrochemical industrial cities in Jubail and Yumba, which is uh, located on the Red Sea and the Arabian Gulf. Uh, since that time, uh, we are focusing actually uh, for the petrochemical uh, industry. Mm -hmm. At the same time, lately, also, so there are uh, opportunities uh, to have invest investment inside the Saudi and uh, we are really achieving uh, a good uh, steps uh, lately. I'm talking about the last 10 or 15, uh, 15 years. Mm -hmm. Could you comment on the volume of uh, economic, uh, business, commercial relationships between Saudi Arabia and Argentina? Well, uh, actually we have a good uh, commercial and uh, uh, relationship uh, between our uh, two countries, uh, I cannot say it's excellent, but it's, we are trying. We are trying to increase the, the, uh, the uh, trade balance between the two countries. Uh, I, I'll give you a very short, uh, very, uh, short example. Uh, trade balance between Saudi Arabia and Argentina in 2006 was $250 million. Now in, two, in 2008 it's $500 million which means that within uh, two years we increase the, the, the balance uh, more than uh, 100%. Mm -hmm. uh, in that uh, part, I can say that uh, in this month, uh, the month of, uh, of May, we will uh, receive a commercial uh, businessman delegation coming from Saudi Arabia, from the Chamber of Commerce of, of Jeddah, to visit uh, Argentina. And uh, lately, we had also an Argentinian businessman delegation who visited Saudi Arabia five months ago. Uh, it means that there is a kind of movement between the two countries. And somebody told me that we have some news, uh, a sort of week of Saudi Arabia in Buenos Aires. But let me ask you about it after the commercial break. Eh, nos vamos a un pequeño corte comercial y enseguida volvemos con más Arabia Saudita en clase ejecutiva.